Hi everyone, welcome to Apple Tech page. Many iPhone users are reporting that iMessage and FaceTime both are greyed out under settings since iOS 17 update. In this video, I will show you how to fix this issue. First solution is Reset Network Settings. Resetting the network settings resets your Wi-Fi networks and passwords, APN and VPN settings and cellular settings. To do this, launch settings app. Next, tap on general. Now scroll down the screen to bottom and tap on transfer or reset iPhone. Tap on reset. Select reset network settings. In the pop-up window, tap reset network settings to confirm the process. Second solution is turn on FaceTime under cellular data. If you are accessing FaceTime and iMessage over cellular data, it should be turned on for FaceTime. To do this, go to Settings app. Next, tap on Cellular or Mobile Data. Scroll down the screen to find FaceTime. Make sure that it's turned on. If it's off, you cannot access FaceTime using cellular data. Third solution is Check Screen Time Settings. If you could not find FaceTime and message under settings, check screen time. For that, go to settings app. Next, tap on screen time. Tap on content and privacy restrictions. Here, tap allowed apps. Make sure that FaceTime is turned on. If it's off, turn it on. Solution 4 is first restart your iPhone. If you have iPhone 8, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14 and 15 series, do the following steps. Quickly press and release the volume up button. Next, quickly press and release the volume down button. Finally, press and hold the side or power button until you see the Apple logo. Don't release this button when you see slide to power off. Solution 5 is Reset All Settings. Resetting the All Settings resets your all customized settings to default settings, but no data or media will be deleted. To do this, launch Settings app. Next, find and tap on General. Now scroll down to bottom and tap on Transfer or Reset iPhone. Here, tap on Reset. Select Reset All Settings. Tap Reset All Settings in the pop-up window. Again, tap Reset All Settings to confirm the process. Thanks for watching this video. Do like, share and subscribe to Apple Tech page.